Hey Excel users, Microsoft has introduced three new functions. Regex Test, Regex Extract, and Regex Replace. But first, let's understand what Regex is. Regex, short for regular expression, is a powerful tool used to check if a string contains a specified search pattern. In Excel, Regex can be utilized for various tasks such as finding, extracting, or manipulating text based on specific patterns. Now, let's explore each of these three regex functions in detail. Before we start, if you like the content, please subscribe to the channel. First function is regex test. As the name suggests, regex test checks whether the pattern matches any part of the provided text and returns either true or false. First, let's see a simple example. Here, I'll write the Excel experience. Now, we want to check whether this contains the word Excel or not. To do this, I'll use regex test. Our first argument is the text we want to check, so I'll select this cell. The next argument is the pattern, so we'll write Excel in quotation marks. Then, we close the parentheses. What do you think the result will be? True? Let's press enter. Oh, it's false. Why? Because of our third argument, case sensitivity. By default, it is case sensitive. This means it is searching for Excel, whereas our text contains Excel with a capital E. If we change the pattern to Excel with a capital E, it will return true. Alternatively, if we want to keep the pattern as Excel, we need to add our third argument and set it to 1, making the search case insensitive. Now, it will return true. That was a very basic example. Now, let's explore a more complex scenario to see how regex test can be used effectively. Here, we have a list of customer data received from different sources, in which there is one column of addresses. And now we want to check whether all the addresses have zip codes or not. For example, a zip code pattern might be six characters long with a specific format like one letter, followed by one digit, and so on. To check this, I'll use regextist on this cell. In quotes, I'll write the zip code pattern. If you find writing this complex pattern challenging, you can take help from AI. Just describe the problem statement and it will generate the solution for you. Now, let's press enter and drag the formula down to apply it to other cells. Here, we receive the answer false, indicating that a zip code is not available in this cell. We can use this information to update our data accordingly. Isn't this cool? Now, let's move on to our next formula, regex extract. As the name suggests, it helps us extract text from our data that matches a specified pattern. Here, we have order details of customers, along with order IDs. Our goal is to extract the order IDs into separate columns. To achieve this, we'll use regex extract. For the text, I'll select this cell. Next, I'll specify the pattern in quotation marks. Let's press enter to see the result. Ah, here we have our first order ID. Now, let's drag the formula down to apply it to other cells. But wait, we notice that there are multiple IDs in some cells. Yet, it's showing only the first one. To extract all IDs, we can add a third optional argument. By default, it's set to zero, which returns the first match only. To return all matches, we'll change it to one and press enter. Now, let's drag it down again. However, we encounter a spill error because it tries to spill vertically. To avoid this, we can wrap the formula in transpose by placing it around the regex extract function inside parentheses. Let's press enter again. Now our IDs are separated into different columns horizontally. Now, let's explore our third formula, regex replace. This function searches for substrings of text that match a specified pattern and replaces them with a replacement string. I have received a list of contact numbers from various databases, all in different formats. My goal is to standardize them into a single format. 
To achieve this, I'll use regex replace. I'll select the cell containing the contact numbers as the text argument. Next, I'll specify the pattern inside quotation marks. Earlier, in ChatGPT, I prepared this pattern, so I'll paste it here and press enter. The function will then replace all instances of the pattern in the data with the specified format in one go. Take help of AI to write these complex pattern. Feel free to share in the comments how you plan to utilize this capability. If you like this video like and share this video with your friends. If you're interested in expanding your Excel skills further, check out my other videos. See you in the next one.